Okay, welcome back to part two. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Um, so, let me just say that didn't work at all. And um, I'm feeling a bit shitty about it. Let me, let me explain. Um, it is now nearly quarter past eight in the evening. And I've been sitting here making these videos since I bust 11 this morning. Uh, I put a lot of time and effort into it. Uh, when I did part two, I, I did a lot of filming. Um, I, I went through all the I went through all, all the normal tickets, checked them against the number, and then I went through all the scratch cards, scratching them off. And checking all them and having to read all the um, rules, regulations and everything. It took a long time to do all that lot. It took me much, much longer to edit it into a video. Um, and at the, at the time of doing it and making a video, I was really pleased because on my very last scratch card, it appeared that I'd won £1,080. <laughs> and uh, I was real chuffed, you know, because that, that kind of um, kind of threw me off track with the whole positive thinking, good luck type of vibe, because that, that kind of proved that, or kind of suggested that it worked and it worked in my favour. Um, so I was feeling good and I was explaining about how I had, uh, how on how I'd approached the situation. I, I've been preparing it for the best part of a week now. Uh, I've been asking people on Twitter and Facebook to send me lots of positive thoughts um, in whatever way they want to manifest themselves. I've done lots and lots of lots of web and book research into luck and what luck really means and how it all came around and how certain cultures promote good luck and how they and what they do to um, uh, achieve it and make it happen for themselves. Uh, so I put a lot of, a lot of work and a lot of effort into making this video and trying out all these different scratch cards and experiments. Now, admittedly, now, now, admittedly, I w kind of went into this with a bit of a blank mind really I was not thinking it's gonna work it's not gonna work I just thought I'm gonna do it and I'm not gonna think of anything because uh, because not because I believe it would change everything and influence the um, outcome of that just thinking if I was to act if I was to go into it thinking negatively, then and nothing did happen, and I would have gone, oh my yeah, here we go. See, see, didn't expect anything. If I had gone into it thinking, oh yes, I'm definitely gonna come out. That's really good. I can feel it. I'm feeling positive. I can feel everyone's positive energy. If I had gone into it thinking like that, then if it didn't work, I would have, I would have had an even bigger fall. You know, I, it would have, it would have hit me even more so. The the way the way I saw it was, I had four possible outcomes. Uh, I could either not win anything at all and therefore it making it all a waste of money. I could make 
it's just a few pounds, just a few quid back, but still be out of pocket at the end of it. Third choice was, third option was, I could break even. I could make all the money back which I spent. Therefore, I would be feeling kind of neutral. Neither good nor bad about myself. And fourthly, the option was I could have won a lot of money and, you know, and, all, and then therefore, that would have kind of, um, would have kind of proven to me about the power of positive thinking and all that malarkey. But as it turns out, I didn't win anything out of any of the um, cards. And, um, and now I'm not going to show you any of the video of me doing it. In fact, I deleted it. Uh, because uh, maybe you can tell by the tone of my voice. I'm a little bit... I'm a little bit gutted about it. I'm a little bit feeling worse for wear about it all. Let me explain. Um, I say I had... I had like 12, 13, 14 scratch cards in total. And a bunch of lottery tickets. And to be honest, I was getting kind of confused with them all. I was scratching away, and that took ages for me doing. I filmed it all and everything. Um, and I hadn't won anything I saw, and I was starting to feel a little bit disheartened about the whole thing, really. And then on the very last scratch card, I came through. I, I won £1,080. It was a one thousand prize and a forty pound prize and another forty pound prize. Uh I was pretty fucking ecstatic about that it was yeah that that's really good. That was doing good. And uh I was chuffed because it's kind of proven my experiment the other way. I had made my money back and I made some more and I put it down to possibly being due to positive thinking, there was good positive thoughts. However, uh, I was, after I was done and dusted and I'd done all the editing and everything, and I was really quite chuffed with myself, I was real happy, smiling and all that. And um, went went out. <laughs> went in the kitchen to have a cup of coffee, and I was, I was checking my scratch card, thinking it's very really good. And um, it's right here actually. And um, as it turns out, I've. I'd read it wrong, and uh, and I haven't won anything. Now, realistically, I should have said I I didn't expect anything. I didn't expect anything else. I I, I thought. I thought maybe I might win one pound out of everything. Uh, but I always knew there was going to be the risk that I wouldn't win anything. The reason I feel so shitty about it is because I generally thought I had won some money. And I really, and because I thought I'd won some money, I can see that positive thinking and being happy and well wishing upon others and all that malarkey does work. And, um, you know, and I won and I felt pretty good about winning. And of course, when I realised I haven't won, 
it was quite a big crash down the road really um, and it's done the exact excuse me it's done the exact opposite of what I set out to do myself it's made me feel really really quite bad about things this soon you know I yeah yeah it's made me feel bad about things and it kind of kind of it kind of says to me that Bad things are always going to happen to me. You know, there's nothing I can do about that. That's just my life. I've just been. It really does feel like I'm in doubt quite a shitty hand in life. And. I. I honestly. I honestly don't know Sorry, no I, I'm just pissed off Basically, all I can do is <laughs> Take my antidepressants Go to bed and Just hope that We're gonna be here to do a video again